Now, countries in Asia are marking one of the most important Buddhist festivals of the year. It's Vesak Day, also known as Buddha Day. Now, it usually takes place on the first full moon in May, but previously events have been disrupted by the pandemic. The BBC's Azadeh Mashiri reports. This celebration isn't meant to be done remotely. And yet for these monks, it's the first time they can mark Visak Day, also known as Buddha Day, together since the pandemic began. Today, it is an important day as it commemorates the birth, enlightenment and the great decease of the Lord Buddha. Celebrated on the first full moon in May, no effort was spared. Worshippers in Thailand laid out thousands of LED lanterns at this temple to mark the occasion. 21,000 to be exact. Some monks were still encouraged to join through Zoom, the spectre of COVID-19 still hovering over the celebrations. But for those who could join, it was a welcome return. I think it's amazing that we can celebrate again in person and, and of course with the right safety precautions, but that we can be back here. As I understand, last two years wasn't possible. So uh, I think it's a great thing, actually. Celebrations also took place in other parts of Asia, in places like Bangladesh, and even Sri Lanka, which lifted a curfew for the event amidst deep political turmoil. Fitting for a day encouraging reflection and new beginnings. Azadeh Mashiri, BBC News.